I think we got really popular way right now is uh, uh, internet blackboard discussion. That's really good. So you can use the internet anytime, like at home in the universities. I think there is uh, an ongoing um, trend towards uh, accessing your, your tutors or your lecturers via um, the internet, uh, via email or via um, Blackboard or WebCT. Um, and I would expect that for maybe minor um, uh, problems that you might have um, with the unit or, or with the assignment, just queries or questions, um, that you would be able to send them an email and hear from them um, perhaps within one to two days. Um, I think that would be a reasonable expectation um, and a fair one. Um, with the weekly assignments, I don't really think they're necessary. <laughs> you know, as long as you have detailed answers on the, the blackboard, you know, all the students are very happy. With um, tests, I think that's where you need more detailed feedback. It can also be done on the website, but it's also good to have more time for um, consultation. Face-to-face um, -face is obviously best, but it's not feasible. Maybe um, there can be an online discussion where the lecturer would come in and see answers, so a lot of people can read through it. It saves time, and also a lot of people travel a lot, so it saves time in the sense that they can go, just go into the web discussion and just read what's going on in the semester, and the lecturer is saying that's pretty much it. I guess emails would be really good, and another thing would be online like the blackboards, uh, uh, you know, discussion panels that we have. In the past, I've seen that a lot of times I might not have a question that I might not know that um, I might have in the future or something. Somebody else has raised the issue and I've got the answer there on the, you know, everyone can see other people's questions as well. So online discussion board, I think, in Blackboard are really helpful. It's always good to have lecture notes that's posted online for students before the lecture so we can have, um, have a look at um, what's expected for that lesson. Um, well, I think the best way, not only for me, but in general, the best way is to um, be uh, very interactive in the online Blackboard discussions because if for instance, one, 100 students might have the same questions. So if a lecturer responds to one question, he is actually responding to 100 questions. And if, if the students are encouraged to um, go into the Blackboard discussions and just check all the questions, and that saves a lot of staff time as well as student time.